guys, welcome back to Clever News. I'm your host, Deidre Behar, joined by Katie Krause. Hey guys. And today in the studio, we have Stephen Coletti here, and we are gonna be playing the ever elegant Clever 15. Nice. Basically a series of 15 super fast paced, hard hitting questions. I just got nervous. So, are like, you nervous? Say, a little bit. Yeah. Uh, no worries. I, have, I have no idea what's coming. But, um, <laughs> but this, no, I'd like for this. Okay, so, yeah, cool. Throw them at me. Let's start. Disneyland or Six Flags? Six Flags. Relaxing weekend at a spa or a crazy weekend in Vegas. <laughs> Think about just had a crazy weekend in Vegas. We'll do a relaxing weekend at a spa. <laughs> That's the subsequent answer. It's Vegas yeah. right now. I can't stand Vegas with the last couple weeks. So lift weights or like go on a hike, do something outdoorsy. Outdoors for sure. Yeah. Your go-to dance move, and I'm gonna need a demonstration. Yeah, oh you have the floor. Oh my god, it's kind of like a sweeping. I can't really do it on this, but there's with with this leg, you're you're kind of going like this. Uh. And then, and then there's like a whoop. It's kind of like a, yeah, a shuffle. It's hard to do. Yeah, there's, it's a bit of a shuffle. Like <laughs> I a also. Shuffle. Doggy yeah. hybrid. Yeah, yeah, you do. There's a crip walk too, because I could say that uh, Snoop Dogg actually taught me how to crip walk. Real really? story? Back when I used to do TRL, yeah. So that, that's a go to too. Good memory to have. Yeah, good definitely. Story. Good skill to After he party. coined me. Even Steven. <laughs> and it was like, all right, that's that's that's, 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 that's my rapper yeah. name, I guess. Television and guilty pleasure. Um that's a good question. Don't hold back. Gold Rush. Oh, yeah. It's a I'm good a big one. like it's National crazy. Geographic uh, Discovery fan. Watched a lot of those shows. And then on Freddie Roach right now, it's an HBO show, but it's always changing. Constantly changing. Cool. Twilight or Harry Potter? Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Solid. Good man right there. <laughs> Uh, the biggest misconception about yourself and clear it up. Misconception. Um, I would say it probably runs from from uh, from Laguna Beach that you know they, they they had me going in this this love triangle and you know Stephen with the big player out there. But uh, I mean yeah I, I'm I'm not not that type of a person. It's not that's not me. So uh, I would say I would say you get that. Eight years ago and you still this is get harsh. you still it's get like, that. No oh, yeah of course. Oh my goodness. Wow. Of course, yeah. Hardcore LC. Yeah, exactly. Stephen Colletti, not a player. <laughs> <laughs> the um, secret talent, hidden talent. Um, juggling. Really? Yeah. Do we have any juggling balls? Can you juggle fire? Um, I can't. I can have three iPhones. I can juggle iPhones. Really? No, I can't. Oh, I was about to say, you can have mine. It's right there. <laughs> mine somewhere. Okay. I would say juggling. Okay. Juggling and a couple of magic tricks. Those are hidden talents, if you will. Okay. Yeah. Celebrity crush, aside from. Chelsea Kane, male and female. I would say female side would be it's a tight race between Charlize Theron and Michelle Williams, and then on the male side, um, that's, I haven't really thought about that, thankfully. But uh, you can say Johnny Depp. I would say I'd probably say Christian Bale actually. <gasps> Yeah, I, I'd, I'd say I'd the say One Tree Hill right. boy romance producer. <laughs> yeah, great indeed. Um, dream actor and actress you would just love to work with? Um, I, th I think that's pretty much the same. Well, I mean, I don't know. I, I think if you have an opportunity to get in a scene with Meryl Streep, then uh, you know, you know, you're doing a few things right. You've made it. But um, you know, I, I I would go with the crushes too. I think those can go hand in hand. So. You know, like I love Blue Valentine. That Ryan Gosling and, and Michelle Williams film was great. Was so do scenes like that would just be would just be incredible, I think. And then, uh, um, yeah. Your One Tree Hill experience in three words. Hmm. Growth, fun, and what would be another third one? An experience. Um, <laughs> pretty, uh, pretty solid. Yeah, good choice. I'll take yes. solid. I'll take solid. Um, an audition you've gone on that you really wanted that you didn't get, and looking back, how do you Speed feel about Speed Racer. It? Yeah. Emil Hirsch. Yes, that's right. Okay. Tell and us I realized about once that. once Emil Hirsch got it, I was like, I'm glad I really went out for that because I'm sure he did not go out for it at all. You know, <laughs> I'm sure it was just like was one of those <laughs> things where, him. yeah, the the role role was handed to him because he was you know blowing up at that point. But uh, yeah, that, I really wanted to be Speed Racer. Okay. And lastly, why do you love Clever News? Three reasons. <laughs> Don't three, mind if we toot our own horn on you. Three reasons. Reason one, <laughs> reason two, and reason three is, is behind the camera. Oh, yay. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. You're too kind. Well, thank you so much for being here and being a good sport. Of course. Playing this game. Thank you for putting me on the spot. I hope I hope that was uh, interesting enough for you. <laughs> yeah, you were very fun. Yeah, Your anxiety's good. okay. I'm good, I'm good. Okay, cool. Thank and again, you. check One Tree Hill out Wednesdays. Yes. On the CW. Yes. It's the best show ever. <laughs> I do not watch it. <laughs>